What's good, YouTube? It's Carefix. Today's video is going to be about why confidence might not be a good thing when a guy's approaching you. I get it. You want to be swept off your feet. You don't want some soft, mumbling ass guy to come up to you looking down at his feet, trembling at the knees, while a single drip of piss runs down his leg. You want a real man to approach you with confidence. You'd like him to be smooth and charming and funny, like Will Smith in that movie Hitch, The Love Doctor. I understand. Confidence is a great indicator of self-esteem. High self-esteem usually comes with good reason. Maybe he's successful and that's why he's so confident. Maybe he's popular and that's why he's so confident. Maybe he's of high status. That could all be true. The problem is that more times than women realize, the reason behind this almost cocky sort of confidence that women respond so well to is completely different. That is, he doesn't give a damn about you. Not even a little bit. If a guy approaches you and he's super confident and loose, there's a chance that he hasn't placed any real value on the success of this interaction. Men who value and respect women in general get nervous about approaching them. This is because they are serious about meeting them or getting to know them. They are hoping that this girl is just as beautiful on the inside as she is on the outside. In many cases, they have already imagined some kind of life with you if they're around you consistently but haven't gotten a chance to really get to know you. They don't want to miss the opportunity of a lifetime by messing up their approach. Think about the things that are really important to you, the things you want to accomplish. Are you so confident in the things you wish you could do that you don't even try? No, you work really hard to accomplish your goals. The very thought of you not accomplishing your goals causes you stress. That brings me to my point, which is, why are women so turned off by indicators of stress when a guy approaches them for a date or to get their number? They label him a nice guy and lie about having a boyfriend. These same women usually complain about not being able to find a good guy that's serious about a relationship. They were turned off by the nervous guy, while that confident guy who got their number and just rolled off of them is already flirting with their best friend. He didn't even have time to wash that thing off first. <laughs> anyway, if a guy approaches you super confident or even cocky, it's most likely because it's just a numbers game to him. He approached 10 women before you, and as soon as he walks away with your number or you say yes to a date, he'll approach another 10 women with the same thing. As my older neighbor put it, women are like buses. I catch a new one every 10 minutes. Don't just be another ride he takes. Learn to look at nervousness differently as more of a signal of sincerity. If a guy's nervous or stressed out when he's approaching you, it's not necessarily because he doesn't believe in himself. It may be because he actually cares about your approval. Listen, I've approached girls for sport and I've approached girls to pursue a relationship. Those are two very different approaches. It will be in your best interest to know the difference. In time, his nervousness will fade, but his commitment won't. Anyway, that's all I got. Click on my picture to subscribe. Click on these videos to see more. Until next time, 